so this is it guys uh, I only have one fish so I'm gonna cook it now that's small but uh, it's better than nothing so let's, let's clean it first let's open that dude up okay I have water oh, look at that a beautiful trout gorgeous okay I'm gonna open it up that's launch for today guys I, I didn't uh, Water. This is pretty basic. This is survival, you know, so it's nothing fancy. I'm gonna rinse it out. Oops. <laughs> you can tell that fish is fresh. It's still jumping. <laughs> yeah, so I rinse it out. Uh, I think I have some real lemon juice to just clean all the impurity. So let me see. That's lemon juice. It's just to make sure that you know everything's cool. Uh, there's no uh, foreign bacteria, stuff like that. So I'm just gonna clean it a bit with lemon inside and out. Okay. I wish there was there were more fish, but I'm gonna go with that for now. So, you know, you just give it a good bath, yeah. If I give it a good lemon bath, bath, yeah. Oops, man. <laughs> the trout doesn't want to go, all right. Last bath. And I'm gonna rinse it out with water. That's it guys, I think we're ready to go. So let me just rinse out the plate. So this is survival we're doing minimum. That's steel, that's a um, um, steel plate. It doesn't break. You drop it, nothing happens. Steel all. Oh, it's made out of steel. Especially if you're gonna go out camping and do outdoor stuff with your family and you have little children, most likely you get stuff like this, steel plates. They don't break and they last, they'll outlast you. Easy. All right, my furnace. frying pan you know I mean it's let's keep it basic but at least you know a minimum hygiene yeah okay so this is done I do have some matching I think what, what is it what is that? matches matches well done guys
until I have some matches, I'm going to turn the mini furnace on. Yeah, it's on. warming up I have some homemade seasoning uh, what is my homemade seasoning uh, I have some uh, guineas and eggs some uh, uh, soup base uh, some Italian seasoning for pasta you know all bunch of things this this main, uh, mini burner do doesn't play. Already it's hot. Oh no, that's the flour. So what am I saying? So, okay, so that's flour. Should we dip it in flour? Why not? I, I have some olive oil with me. So let's throw it in, in there. All right. And that dude here, why not? Uh, no, let me get some salt and pepper. We're gonna go draw salt and pepper, okay? Yeah. All right. I hear you. Yeah, I hear you. So let's open this up. I hear you, man. Yeah. Okay. Just a bit of salt, not too much. I'm gonna put the cap back on like this. Sprinkle, yeah. You know. And I'm gonna throw it in there, guys. Yeah. Bingo. Easy. That's fresh fish. It doesn't take long to cook. All right, we're gonna let it cook. Uh, yeah, some pepper and carrot. Same thing. Let's just sprinkle it like this. Oh, the wind. The wind knocked it off. Okay. All right. Cook, my friend. Cook. Yeah. Some days fishing is slow. You know, like today. Uh, I lost uh, two, three catch. You know, it, it, it sucks, man. Every time you, you drop a fish, <laughs> good luck and catching uh, another one, you know? So maybe later, you know, in the afternoon, maybe things will pick up. Will start to pick up. Flip it. Yeah. 
Yeah. I'm gonna get a small plastic bag to put all my uh, garbage in so we keep this place clean. So if someone else wants to use it so they have a, a clean environment to um, work with. No, I'm not going to drink water, I'm going to have soda, but don't do this at home. Oh, oh, oh. Check this out, guys. Check this out. Olive oil is good for you, you know. Uh, guys, you know, with all this pandemic and stuff like that, I'm gonna make sure that my fish is well cooked. You know, I'm not gonna have anything like raw or semi-raw, you know. Yeah, I'm gonna make sure that it's, it's, it's cooked properly, okay? A little bit more and, and, and we're good. In the meantime, in between time, I'm gonna put my stuff back like this. This is good. This is flour. Uh, my knife, which is very useful, and it's guard. Yeah, it's safe like this. And uh, yeah. I'm gonna shut this. Okay. I hope I'm gonna catch some other fish so I can maybe cook them later. But for now, this will give me the strength to uh, fish some more. All right, I think, yeah, I think we're good. Yeah. We're good. And we're gonna turn it off. Bingo. Yeah. And of course, guys, the excess oil, you know, we don't need it, so. So there you have it guys, a nice fresh rainbow trout. Okay, yeah. So I'm gonna eat, shall we? And my little uh, furnace, I mean uh, burner, is very easy to dismantle. This is off. Uh, you just unscrew it. Don't do nothing like very hard, so you're gonna have problems to undo it. Okay, so that's it. Uh, and this one too. There we go. Ta-da!
there we go. The view is very, very important. So, no choice. I'll tell you what it tastes like. Good. Good stuff. Look at the, the big pigness of the flesh. Look, it's beautiful. The meat is tender. It is very tasty. Wow. Look. Wow. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Now I'm very motivated to catch some more. Yeah. Mm. What a blessing. Very fresh, very tender. The flesh melts in your mouth. And all that was free, free, free. Trout fishing in this region is free, free, free. But you, you gotta be able, you must be able to catch it. Mm. This fish is so good. Each member of the family should have one by himself. And there's nothing toxic for the environment, so this can go down, nothing's gonna happen. It's biodegradable. Degradable. And it's recyclable. Some animals, like fox or whatever, wild cats, will eat the rest. Mm. It was good, man. Mm. That's my soda.
Oh, the plate. No stress. You just rinse it out, man. Yeah, no stress. <coughs> Not just little children, me too. I've stopped it at least three times already. <laughs> So what, the frying pan? No, the frying pan, the oil, what you do, I'm going to get some uh, uh, napkins and just wipe it off. The oil will keep it uh, nice and, uh, and ready for next time. It's oil, you know, oil doesn't go bad. Let me show you all you This was for the garbage. It's important to do this. So next person who comes here gets a nice and clean place to eat. Okay, this is good. the frying pan it's easy stuff like that you just yeah you just wipe it up yeah you see I learned that in school They have cooking classes for for uh, teenagers and uh, young people. They teach you how to get by and cook uh, minimum stuff. So this way you're not stuck. And they told us if you want your frying pan to last, don't put no st uh, stainless steel sponges or stuff like that. When you finish, you just wipe it off. Yeah. This is over 30 years old. I am speaking the truth. This is over 30 years old. This frying pan. And this one too. You're not, you're not gonna see uh, uh, stainless, I mean, uh, steel plates. <laughs> Everything is made out of uh, plastic nowadays. You, you're not going to find steel plates. No way, no how. I'm still hungry, so I'm going to have a giant cookie. And I have my soda, and yeah, that's a chocolate, chocolate chips cookie. Yeah, that's a giant one, a big size. Yeah, good. Mm. Wow. Thank you so much for watching, guys. 
you guys take care always.